I saw this one and of course I had to play it because I myself less than three money or I love the money. You should see the stuff I do at my day job for the money because I love the money. So with all that said, we're going to be using Geraldo the Geraldo, the Mystic Mustache. Round 100, crazy regrow, crazy mob health, crazy ceramic health, all camo, all regrow. So the whole shebang, they're throwing it all out on this one. What do we have to use? Well, I just want to use Geraldo. Do we have enough money for everything? We do. And then we have enough for his shops. Like what if we just put down like two of these guys like that and like five of these, three, four five put down four of these can Geraldo solo a challenge I doubt it right like that's this isn't gonna happen but I mean we're really cool though we'll do that flamey thing to him we'll put some bunnies down because why not we'll give him some camo we'll put some glues down put some totems down put another totems down and then 10 of these spikes right here just like that. And then I think we can even sharpen these ones. Oh yes, so let's sharpen these two just like that. Oh my goodness, let's pickle juice everybody too because I think that pickles everybody. Yeah, cool, let's do it. Round $185,000 left, but I just don't trust it. You know, like I feel like that's still not gonna be enough. So let's get a mad too because just in case we did all that work for nothing you know what i mean that would be kind of crazy let's go for it boom okay so oh what are you doing over there oh okay right there uh it doesn't look like maybe it is maybe oh and we can't really see like what his damage is or what oh like jesus look at all those <laughs> i've never used all like five tack thingies at once that was madness that was really cool okay let's use this again it doesn't look like this is going to be the answer but i really enjoyed that that was really cool to see well, we could like give this guy chili peppers and we could also like, hmm, let me think here. We could quickly like lock this guy into place like that. And then we'll get like these guys right here, like one, two, three, and we'll get his shop on them like that. And then we'll get some capes. Boom. And that is 100% not the answer. Oh, I thought it would have been, but definitely not gonna be. Now I'm trying to put my mind into someone else who also loves the money making a challenge like this. And Geraldo does like wonders for sharpness. Like, so just the other day, I was just messing around, right? Just have mind my own business, having some fun. I think we only need to go up like a little bit here. We just need sharpness and yeah, sharpness is fine. And if you go to like this one, so this one, you can't go to the top path one. And then you like alk buff him. Boom, 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 boom. and you give him the village this thing alone can do some massive nasty damage just like that and then i think for the finale i'll go carpet of spikes no carpet of spikes it's a good thing anyway because everyone would just give me a hard time about which cross path i use i would say don't go to the top one don't go to the bottom one and i, I don't want to hear that right now because i need to win and we're struggling already. I think this is pretty good. I know we have a lot of money left over, but I want to see what this will do because I just want you guys to see this. Like watch his damage just go ballistic. I guess you really don't have much for reference, but I was testing this in sandbox the other day with like without this stuff and with this stuff. And it's it's pretty intense. Just putting the sharpness on there with the alk buff. It's crazy. We do have a one bandaid on him. Now we've seen the arm floaties. So that's not going to fly for that one, unfortunately. I just spent all this time like setting up Grandmaster to realize that I can only use 10 towers or like 11 or so. So I can only get times 10 on the Shinobis. I did sharpen this one, which was kind of cool. And there, I had to go to like level 20 so I can get three sharpening stones because I thought I'd have more money to buy all the crazy stuff. It didn't work out that way. But I think this looks kind of good right like this could do some damage so let's give it a shot and we'll sell Geraldo now that we did all that and we'll get a village here well the village doesn't see camo so we can't pop lead uh let's just see well like obviously this can't be right though huh because we can't pop ddt's but those things can i think right these things oh the genies can yeah yeah yeah, yeah. we could do it i still love that the whirly gig is super awesome but not gonna happen i think i've stumbled onto something legend of the night is two hundred sixteen thousand dollars, and this one is two hundred thirteen thousand two hundred and ninety nine. but i love money so i know how to get some more of it like this i think right like that oh we are so close what do i gotta do we we're almost there to get more money oh because maybe i could have gone like this triple discount village okay so we'll go one two am i doing this right and then you go like that and then you just go like that and then i can like buy these for cheaper now i got three villages that are like times two so when i place this guy down he's like so cheap you know what i mean so like right there let's just place him there just for science right we'll go like that all the way up to there and then we'll sell 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 Oh my goodness, 216, and then how do we get more? Eureka, I found it. So, okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go like that, and then we're gonna buy this guy on the three one, 
just like that. One, two, three, four. Then we're gonna buy this one all the way up to favored trades and sell these ones. That was stupid, that didn't work. I thought it would work for sure, but it didn't, it was dumb. So if we do something like super tricky like this, right? We'll buy both of the discounts like we already had done. And then we'll buy an elite sniper. And what I'm thinking here is we'll also get this one, like we just did in front of the little thingy there. And we'll buy Legend of the Night. And let's go with one more as well. So we'll go like this. One, two, three, four. Okay. So the goal here is we're going to use these abilities. These abilities are going to hopefully make us enough money. If I can use them twice, right? Is this even on the right ball path? Ballpark path? Okay. So we're going to go one, two, three. Okay, we made a lot of money, but the sell price isn't gonna be there. So we need to do it again. Well, we can, we can do it like two more times, honestly. So we'll go one, two, three, and we collected all our money. I don't think we're gonna have enough time. So we're gonna have to sell all these guys. We did it, we did it. Oh my gosh, I think that actually worked. Does it take down bads? It does, that's all you gotta do. You just gotta use your noggin. This guy is itching for me to try his challenges. Day four of putting into my comment section. So regrow control by the awesome Phoenix. Round 79. That's a different one. Kind of liking it already. And if you guys didn't know, leave me your challenge codes in the comments and I will get to them as fast as I can or try to get to them all. I don't even know what's in round 79. So I guess we'll just go with a downdraft because there's three of them. Like that's the third tier. That would make sense. Oh, it's regrow control. Okay, so we're going to go like that and regrow it and this guy like right there and i don't know like that one maybe and we'll super brutal him I, I don't really know and then like that right we just need to pop him can we even see camo oh i i screwed that one up only that guy can see camo okay looks like we're doing it though how are we gonna pop a bfb what the heck um this is a little confusing maybe if we like go faster too like that okay cool we'll go like primary training too and heck we'll get camo we'll get camo too no, 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 come back, come back. Okay, cool. Oh, okay, the Moabs have like low health probably, right? Okay, we're doing it. We are actually doing it. This is a really fun one. So he has to like go and then they take him down and let me see what this health is real quick. No, it's normal health. So why are they blowing up so easily? Oh, 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 because that guy's little icicles thing, right? And so when he actually pops up, oh, no, 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 no. Now we're, we made it this far. No, 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 no. Oh, but I'm popping them and I can get them back. I'm professional at getting them back. Okay, if, as long as I can pop some more. Come on, come on, two more, two more. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we're almost there. Oh, we did it, we did it. Okay, I popped them both. So he's got to like shove them back. Oh, no. What I'm thinking is we want to keep the regrows because once we get the regrows, we need as many blooms as we can with the Moabs. If we pop them all, so uh, it's just kind of tough to like figure out where to place everything. We do not want to pop them all because then he can't use his icicle poppy power. Look at that's why we're popping these is because he's using icicles. And so if we pop all the blooms, we're done for. And we just popped all the blooms. So basically we need to regrow them back and like bring them back to this guy so he can do his icicles. So we will try it like this and I'll just leave this guy back here, but he pops them so well well and they're they're not regrow anymore because he's like you know the icicle or impaler dude so maybe we just need like icicles and not get embrittlement but no we really need like super brutal things killer uh let's see here i don't want to lose like this kind of craziness we just got to push them all back huh but he is missing some of them which is nice and then i'm hitting them back <laughs> we will see no we, we lost on that one again this is a very interesting challenge i will say that for sure so now we have too much of a regrow overgrow and i'm not really sure what to do about it i guess i I could go like regrow blocker like would that help out no, no, no we're gonna lose like one huh no we have oh we have lives we have lives we have a lot of lives oh i didn't even notice that so if the problem is that we're having the balloons be popped before the like final bfbs and zmgs come out what if we have this guy here instead so something like this one two three that and then have him see camo we'll get this guy here and then we'll put this guy up here and we'll save up for twenty three thousand dollars but i think this should work out because now they're frozen he pops them all and we send some of them back this doesn't seem to be working either well since we have all those lives this is, seems to be working out pretty well i'm just sending everything back like i'm letting them get further right like we'll get, let them go and then we'll go boom, 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 send them all back like that now we have some more there and then we'll get some more there we can kind of send see what i'm doing here it's working out we're sending them back sending them back he'll pop them all hopefully and we have like a good leeway of lives i think i think i could be wrong we do have a lot of balloons right here that are about to just wreck us aren't they so maybe i should put like another like icicle and brittle at the end right there there hmm <laughs> look at something kind of weird like this because then we have like unlimited pops forever pretty much we can get this guy to embrittlement he can pop everything now 
And then we'll also get like the village to speed both of these guys up. This looks like it could be something here. I kind of like this. And we can like even grow blocker it too to make sure like we just don't get wrecked at the end. Boom, 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 boom. Get some of that faster stuff too. The jungle drum. So now we're both super fast because what I'm doing here is the guy at the beginning now has the balloons to pop. So look, he still has his EMG out there and he can still pop it is my kind of intention for that. But I don't know if it's going to work, but we did. We got all the balloons now. Look at that. That's awesome. We cleared it. We just have to get rid of the ZOMG. I don't think we lost a single life. So I'm just going to start popping like crazy here. And we're popping it down too. I think this might be it. Heck yeah. I wish I could sell though because unfortunately like that, that one down there. But so we got down to four BFBs. And what's that going to do? Probably not much. It does slow them down though. That's really cool. Maybe if we can pop them down to all Moabs. Can we? Can we? I don't think so. And we got... We got totally wrecked. Now, I think we were onto something there, though. I think what I'm going to do now is not get the regrow blocker. I think that's where I went wrong. And we're just not going to get embrittlement. I think that's our problem because now we have these regrows still here. We need the regrows so we can have like a regrow farm because I think that's like the name of the title even. So that makes more sense. So we'll get this one to go faster. We'll get primary training even. And then our saving grace is this guy down here, right? And so if he can just like not die, come on, not die. Get them. Get them. There we go. Get more. Get that ZOMG. Oh, we're losing so many lives. Oh, this is crazy. We're going to even have more coming after us. What if I can like stop them up here though? Like stop them. <laughs> stop, 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 stop. One more time, one more time, one more time. Boom, boom, boom. He's actually doing a lot of... Dude, this guy does so much damage. It's crazy. Okay, keep going. A little bit more. A little bit more. Don't lose. I think this might be it. If we can pop this like BFB thing or this like fortified mob like that. Pop this one. He has a black eye already. We can knock him out. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. One more, one more. No, one more. Come on. Don't lose like this. Oh my goodness. We had it. We had it in the bag. So this time I changed up the spots of everything because I want this guy to get the good juice. And then he can go faster, stronger, whatever he needs to do. And we'll just zap them all back to him like that. And we just need that ZOMG. Come on, start popping that ZOMG right now. Just keep doing it. Boom. It was too fast, unfortunately. Oh my gosh, the Super Brutal was too fast. So we'll have to wait to upgrade to the village later on. We don't need it just yet. This one is tricky. It's like it's like a specific amount of inputs here, and it is difficult. I think I'd be better off letting it be like overwhelming. So there we go. We overwhelmed it. That was too much overwhelming. But we're going to have a lot of balloons, though, which is good. And I'm just making a fat regrow farm here. And I think I can do it now. Go like that. There we go. Keep going, buddy. Maybe even like that one. Was that too much, maybe? No, I think we're good. And I'm going to start like a bigger one up here. Get it going. And then now I can just like let him go. Just keep attacking him. Okay, maybe. Yes. Yes, it is sort of working. Heck yes. So we popped all the Moabs. Okay. And all we have to do is pop this BFB thingy. We might actually take it down to BFBs before it gets away. That would be amazing. Oh my goodness. We did it. We popped it before. So that means we're going to get more damage on it than we had last time. Come on, buddy. I don't know if he can though. No, he can't. He can't. There's way too many for him. So here we try it again, but this time I went with quad darts to get like more damage on. Here we go. Here's that one. Can we pop him? We do. We do. We pop him, don't we? Yes. Oh, so I'm gonna try placing him back here to see if we get like a little bit more action. Like if it takes longer, so that might be better. I just don't understand how it works. Like, look at this. Like, that should be a big zapper right there. Like, poof. Like, that should take down the ZOMG like one shot, you'd think. So this might have been beneficial to wait longer because now that the icicle and brittle is gonna help. Well, with the embrittlement, now we're actually going to get some like crazy pops going here because he's going to help break it down, I imagine. I think that's how that works. But unless we can get him down to Moabs and then less than that, I don't see this being that helpful, to be honest. I feel like we were so close too. But then we just get overran with the Moabs. We've seen balloons. Balloons, I tell ya. So here we go down to BFBs and this might work out. Moabs right now, like right this second. Okay, we did break them down beforehand, but it's just still too much, huh? There's just not going to... We've already done this. We got that one. We got that one. Get this one too. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Eight lives, eight lives. Oh no. Try 83, see what happens here. We have just so many, we'd have to pop them all and I just don't see that happening. Yeah, he just doesn't do it, he, he sucks, he really sucks. So this is kind of working. I put the other guy lower and then I'm like taking on like each Moab on its own and it's actually working out really well so far, so far, yes. Okay, another one, another one. Okay, cool, we can do this again. Okay, we can do this. We can do this. Use those ice shards. Oh my goodness, come on, buddy. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my God, I could cry right now. That took way too long. And if you haven't yet, check out this video where we use the balloon spawner mod to fight balloons versus balloons. Fire with fire. BTD6 won't know what hit it.